this is Jess from Make and Do Crew, and in this quick video tutorial, we're gonna learn how to crochet a Romanian cord. And this is a nice, strong, and stable cord that you can use as a purse strap, or a belt, or any other time you need an easy cord to make for a crochet project. In fact, this is what's used to make the straps in my Street Fair Boho Bag pattern, which you can find for free on makeanddocrew.com. Today we're gonna to be using Lion Brand 24-7 cotton, which is a perfect yarn to show off the stitch definition of this cord. It's important to note that in the bag pattern, you're gonna be using two strands held together, but for the ease of seeing what's happening here, we're gonna just use one strand. So I'm starting with a slip knot on my hook, and we're gonna begin by chaining two. And after we've chained two, we're gonna work a single crochet into the second chain from the hook. And now that we've got that first single crochet, I'm gonna rotate my stitch clockwise because I'm right-handed. If you're left-handed, you're gonna do the same thing, you're just gonna rotate it the other direction, which is counterclockwise. So I'm rotating it this way, and you can see I've got two lines of my V going right here, and they're pointing toward a little bar at the back of the stitch. So I'm gonna insert my hook underneath that bar from the top down, yarn over and complete a single crochet. So that's my next single crochet. Now from here, every subsequent stitch is gonna be worked the same way, and that is that we're gonna rotate this again clockwise, and I'm going to work under the two bars that are at the back of the stitch now. So you can see I've got my V here, and they're pointing, the two lines of the V are pointing to the back of the stitch, which has two bars. There, so I'm gonna work under the two bars now. The beginning there was only one bar, now there's gonna be two bars each time. And I'm gonna work my single crochet right under those stitches and single crochet. So after I complete that, I'm gonna rotate it again, find the bars at the back of the stitch, and insert my hook, yarn over, and complete my single crochet. So this whole cord is just working that stitch over and over again. We're always rotating clockwise if you're right-handed and counterclockwise if you're left-handed. And we're just always working directly under that back two bars at the end of the V. So now you can just continue like this until you have the length of cord that you need for whatever you're making. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, I'd love it if you gave it a thumbs up. And please subscribe to my channel for more free crochet patterns and tutorials just like this. Happy crocheting!